Today I am very excited to share with you guys one of my new favorite Google tools located in your Google Drive. It's called Google Keep. Google Keep is a note-taking program that's synced on your Google Drive. It offers a user-friendly and easy way to take notes. If you are a fan of post-it notes, or if your desk looks anything like mine, then you are going to be a big fan of Google Keep. If you use Gmail or Google Calendar, Google Docs, and Google Sheets, your Google Notes is going to be synced through your Google Drive and everything works together seamlessly. So today I'm going to look at how we can use Google Keep on a desktop or laptop computer. So step one, I've opened up Google Chrome and I am going to click on my waffle iron or also known as the Google Apps button. And I'm not going to find Google Keep as one of the apps listed, but if I click more, you will find that Google Keep is a yellow background with a light bulb icon. And if you click on that, it's going to take you to your Google Keep homepage. It starts right here by telling me on one blue post-it note what's new in Google Keep. It gives you a little install instructions on how to get the Google Keep Chrome extension, but I got it. I'm not going to really worry about that right now. I'm going to start with a fresh blank Google Keep page. The first thing I want to do is create a note. I am going to make something very simple and say, hey, I need to pick up the milk on the way home. I'm going to click done. It's going to automatically take that note, put it into a cool little post-it note onto my Google Keep page. And I'm going to change my color to the old-fashioned yellow post-it note style. Very classy. I love how that looks. So let's make another note. I remember tomorrow morning I have to speak with Leslie tomorrow morning after bus arrival. I'm going to click done. And maybe anything that I have work-related, I want to color orange for Mahanasan. So if I'm looking at some of my notes real quick, I can quickly pick up what is either work related or wife related. The next thing that I want to share with you guys is how you can set reminders on your notes. This icon right here with the little finger pointing up is remind me and if you click on it, I'm going to set a reminder when I want to remember this note. Tomorrow, 8 o'clock, that's a little bit early. I want to change it so I'm going to click on the time Click right here where it says 8. I'm going to custom, oops, custom 9 a.m. Don't want it to repeat. Click save. And there we go. Tomorrow at 9 a.m., everything that's hooked up to Google Keep, which is my laptops, also my phone, and my iPad, or any phone, smart device, any tablet, is going to send you a reminder at 9 o'clock saying, hey, I need to speak with Leslie tomorrow right after bus arrival. So this is just a very fun and easy way to set up all of your notes. So right now, I'm going to do some video editing magic and create a whole bunch of notes on my Google Keep page. Okay, now that I have some notes on here, you can easily organize them any way you want by clicking and dragging and putting them in any setup that you like. There's even an easy way to set your most important notes and keep them pinned to the top. So let's say tomorrow my meeting with Leslie is one of my most important notes that I need to remember. If I click this little pin icon, it's going to automatically pin it to the very top. So that's going to easily remind me when I look at my Google Keep page what is pinned and what everything else I have down below, uh, however I want to organize it. So I can easily see here what I have pinned and everything else, all my other notes down below. So let's say now I have already picked up my milk on the way home, I'm done, I don't need it anymore, I wanna delete the note. In order to delete the note, you're gonna click this three little circle button icon down here, the more, and click delete note. It's as simple as that, the note is deleted. If you wanna undo it, you can click the undo button down there and it will fix the mistake if you accidentally deleted it, but I want this to be totally gone, deleted, goodbye. The last thing that I want to share with you guys today is how to share these notes with other people across Google platforms. If you have their email, all you need to do is click this collaborator icon and type the person or email that you want to share your note with. Since this is about Leslie, I'm going to type in her name 
click Save, and it's going to send her a notification about that note. There are so many other cool features that Google Keep has to offer to help you keep organized across the board. So at this point, I want you to play around with your Google Keep notes, make some new post-its, change the color, see if you can maybe add a collaborator, maybe even add a picture if you're feeling dangerous. And next time, we will really dive into some of the more intricate tips, tricks, features that Google Keep has to offer to help you keep organized across the board. Have a good night, and I'll catch you next time.